Friends, it's Curtis Robinson operating Black Blade, the deadliest of all assassins, and right now he's kind of been the beat up of all assassins. Um, the Lake of Rot just really whipped me, but we ultimately were able to kill the bad guy that we were looking for. Um, we now have some other things we're going to do. We're here at the Grand Cloister. This is the Grand Cloister um, Grace. I was over here fighting the dragon guy. And of course, that's where we started at. So this whole place is just an awful, awful place. I thought Caleb was bad. This place makes Caleb look like a freaking like Disneyland or something. Needless to say, we're gonna have a little bit of fun here. We're gonna go ahead and get back to our other weapons here. Alrighty. Um, oops. Let's kind of switch back here. All right, I don't think I'm going to need these um, immunities anymore. So I'm going to take those down, and I'm going to go back to, let's put that up, give me a little extra damage, let's put, I don't think what I'm going to fight against, let's put the dexterity back up. Okay. I am a dexterity build after all, so that does make sense. Now there are going to be a bunch of dudes that are going to be trying to kill me. And that's pretty much par for the course. So we're going to just do our best not to uh, allow them to succeed. And do a little hopping around, a little jumping around, a little parkour action here. You're going to see all those dudes down there. We're going to have to ultimately deal with them some way. Alright, so all of these cool runes are going to help us level up a bit. And there is always a good, better, and best way to do things. And I think if we jump down right here, I think we're going to have an opportunity to get a little closer and start shooting people, do a little archery work here. I think I'm going to move the bow back over to the other side. Duvia back where it belongs on this side. Alrighty. Yep. Let's go ahead and do that. I moved it for the sake of weight. But now that I'm kind of back in business here, I'll be able to rock and roll. Alright. So this is the first little oops. Jump down or drop down not too terribly difficult and the next one shouldn't kill us let's make this jump but think but these guys can now freaking shoot the piss out of us kind of keep that in mind we're gonna want to kill them as quickly as possible once they start shooting you it's just total pain in the butt I'm lucky he won't start using his little magic ability. And there he goes. Let's hit him again. Probably should drink. I got one. Alright, hey. We've got plenty of arrows. We should be able to do some business here with this guy. Unless he goes around the corner, which sucks for me. So this arrow will follow him. It'll track a little bit on his movement. I feel like I'm at one of those shooting galleries, right? Where the little ducks or the little whatevers go back and forth. <laughs> so I'm on the high ground so he can't easily hit me with his weapon. But he does have a shooting ability that he just chose not to use. Frankly, I'm really grateful for that, because 
he can really do a lot of damage with those spines, whatever it is that he has. Now you might notice that on the left side of my screen, there's that gravestone again. That means I can use my um, Ash of War, which is pretty stinking helpful. Oh, look at there. Uh, what are we going to do here? Let's see. Get up here, and if he shoots at me, I can drop down and have some cover. He doesn't even care. I'm perfectly happy shooting him. If he doesn't care, doesn't move, I'm okay with that. He's like, I just want you to kill me. That's what it is. Happy to oblige, sir. Drink. Now I am pretty heavy on um, this is all scarlet rot. If I walk across, it is going to gank me up a little bit, but I do have a spell for that. I'm not going to be in it for long. Let's switch back to knives just in case somebody pops up around the corner here. All right, not too bad. Ah, a little nascent butterfly. Let's get those. Let's jump across here. Pick up a few things. All right, there's another dude right over there. I killed these guys. I might as well pick up their stuff. All right, now, oh, look at there. Is he coming for me? Hmm. I'm in a good place to fight him, that's for sure. He is definitely interested in me. And I'm in freaking animation hell. Got him. Let's see if we can do a little beautiful vitality here. Maybe that'll heal him up without having to waste it. A, a, um, a red flask. So there is something down there. Two somethings actually. I do want to get those. Uh, I think I'm going to end up changing back just briefly to put Nox Greaves on and these and that. That'll give me a little bit of immunity. Let's go back to equipment. Dang it, I'm gonna have to go put all this back on. Necklace and immunization charm. So this one is better than that one, and this one is different from that one. Gosh, I'm wondering if I can put that one on as well. Let's just take a look. I'm curious now. Nope, I can't put it on. Because I got the one that's in that same category. Okay. So, we're going to zip on over there and see if we can get that. Now, there's nowhere for me to go, so I'm going to have this ability up. Flame cleanse me once I get my Scarlet Rot maxed out. Hopefully I can heal it up a bit. I'm going to try and make the run to pick up and the heal. Oh, I did not mean to roll. And look at there. It's an ulcerated freaking turd sickle. I hate those guys. All right. Let's see if we can escape them a little bit and get my dude up. I'm in a corner. Hopefully my guy helps me out a bit. Not bad. Right now I think I'm back to ready. Right, let's see if we can get in on him. Close is better than far for this guy. Oh, 
almost sacked me. Try to get away from that. Nah, I could drink. I, I should have been able to hide. That was the plan. See, I'm so big. Did I get him? Holy oh, crap, I got him. And I think I got all of my stuff back. Golden seed. And my mimic tier did well. He didn't die. Alright, back to three and six. That works. I'm gonna switch back to looking cool again. back on here so we can get back to work doing what we're doing here <laughs> sorry about all the delaying but uh, you know, everything has a purpose here we go where's dexterity right there all right so my mimic here can still kind of help me out a bit all right and I'm out of juice let's drink some juice we can pull these guys one at a time. Let's see if we can do that with the bow here. If they come all at one time, I'll be freaking sunk. But my mimic tier is still here. Let's try to get these guys. Stabby action on him. The Pest Glaive. Let's go ahead and do Beast of Vitality. Get that going. Alright, should we pull one? bit. Take care of business that way. This technique is working nicely. These aren't really the most difficult guys, to be honest with you, but they can be a pain in the butt. He's got the aggro. A couple guys remain. Not doing poorly. My guy threw a fireball. Look at there, Ghost Glove Wart 9. Nice. I'll be using that for sure. 
there one more guy up here? Looks like he's kind of worshiping something. Let's backstab, do backstab. Cleaned him up, man. Cleaned him up. Let's get this guy going here. And let's go ahead and redrink. Not too bad. So I think that we've done. I'm trying to think if there's anything at all. Is that our coffin? That might be the coffin that we're looking for. So we don't want to rest in the coffin. That takes us to the next area. Let's go inside. I may have another boss to fight. I can't remember for some reason. suspiciously like a chest and I can't remember if I'm gonna get snaggled it but I'm gonna give it a shot scorpion stinger what a great weapon it does scarlet rot and it's a dagger can you stink and believe it let's go ahead and just look at it it'll be glorious if oops where am I going here we go scorpion dagger does scarlet rot at 50 it is a special, so my guess is I'm going to have to um, uh, put some solder smithing stones on it. And I get repeating thrust. Sweet! Such a great weapon. Such a cool weapon. Uh, it'd be worth playing with it right now, even without a lot of solder smithing stones to make it better. Just because of the uh, you know, Scarlet Rot that it, pro it procs. All right, friends, well, we've done a good job. I'm going to go ahead and tell you that uh, the next piece is going to be in my next video. We're going to rest in this coffin. So again, we started off here. We cleared this area in one video. We fought the bad guy, the first bad guy, another one. It took me forever. But anyways, got back over here, cleared the Grand Cloister, and now we're ready to rest in this coffin. So we're going to cut it, and I'll catch you guys on the next video.